Hi everyone, I'm Kaden, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. In the last episode, we a lot happened. Let's see, there was we had our first harvest. We got to farming level one, which means we can make that scarecrow for that one quest. Uh, we got a sword, and we were started to go into the mines. We sold our first harvest. We received a furnace blueprint from Clint because we went into the mines. We started to collect some ores. Let's see. Uh, the mayor opened the community center for us, so we can start getting those uh, community bundles done once we actually are able to read what's inscribed on those little pl glowing plates. And then we also planted our first wild crops, the wild forage crops. So let's start off today by getting the weather report for tomorrow. And it's going to be clear and sunny all day, which means we will have to water our crops tomorrow. And for our luck today, the spirits are mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. So, you know, we should be doing the geodes, we, the mines, really, we should be going to the mines either just because it will be easy to find the ladders. And then we had a queen of the sauce. Now this gives us cooking recipes to cook in our kitchen, which we don't have. But uh, the first house upgrade that we get will include a kitchen. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish, Stir Fry. It's a perfect way to get some healthy greens on your plate. Saute the greens in a little sesame oil and make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Now breathe deeply, oh that's good. You learned how to cook stir fry. Alright, well now that we've learned how to cook stir fry in our non existent kitchen, let's go ahead and water our crops. Oh, we have mail. Let's check this first. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have inf information concerning your rat problem. M. Rasmodius Wizard. Now he's gonna be the guy that. It's gonna help us read what's on those packets. All right, oh, oh, it looks like our potatoes are in. Let's grab these real quick. Let's see if we get any extra ones. Oh, we did. We got some extra ones. We got a couple extra ones. So we start off with uh, 10. We've got 14. That's cool. All right, let's get some water first real quick. Let's water these. Uh, today is Sunday the 7th, but actually today is Sunday the, um, it, today is Mother's Day, so today is Sunday the 8th, so pretty close dates. Anyway, today is the mayor's birthday, you may have remembered that I took a look at the calendar in the last episode. Which, by the way, this episode is not going to be 40 minutes long. I'm going to cap it at most 25 minutes. So I think we're only going to get like one episode or one day per episode. That's okay. I'm going to be uploading two episodes a week. All right. So now it's 9 a.m. Our little thing is going uh, crazy. Meet the wizard. You received a letter from the local wizard. He claims to have information regarding the old community center. So we have to go there sometime today as well. Let's go ahead and start selling these potatoes. We don't need them right now. We do need the cash. Alright, now let's go over to the general store. Let's buy some more potatoes and replant them. But let's go check for some wild forage and shake these trees. But then again, I don't think we're going to get anything because of our luck. Oh, hey, look. Daffodil. Daffodil? Oh, don't water it. Daffodil, yes. Oh, we got something. Now all we need are the other ones so we can actually make those wild forage seeds again. Or what we can do is we can give this to Maru if he can run into her. Actually, let's see if she's working right now. Nope, no Maru. Harvey's here though. Let's go say hi to Harvey. Hmm, 
I'm struggling to make ends meet. I don't have enough patience. Well, it's a small town. Not many people live here, but then again, you're the only clinic, so I don't see why they would be going anywhere else. Let's just double check this. Yeah, see, it's Boost's birthday today. We'll go find him somewhere. He's probably at home. And George is over here wheeling through the store. Alright, something I forgot to mention, this whole area inside the general store is like a the new community center. I want to go say hi to Abigail. You're not good enough friends with Pierre or Caroline to enter the bedroom. Oh well. Anyway, this is uh the new community center, so to speak. Uh, they do certain things here, and this is... They have some kind of odd religion here. Uh, it's called... Yoba. Uh, I'm not quite sure exactly what it is. I haven't played long enough to really figure it out. But anyway, let's get those seeds. Let's go say hi to Jody. I'm taking a break from, from house chores today. Well, it's Sunday. It's Mother's Day. You can go ahead and take a break. Now, I think she is Vincent's mother. Anyway, let's go buy those seeds. Hi, right, Pierre. Let us buy. Let's see, take 10 days, so that would be the 17th. Then they keep growing. Hmm. Let's go ahead and get five of these. They create little posts, and you can't really get around them that easily. And then let's go ahead and actually get these kale seeds. Let's buy 10 of these and we'll just expand that plot of land up a little bit. Make it 3 by 5 instead of 5 by or 5 by 2 So we'll say hi to Haley. No, don't water Haley. Say hi to Haley. My sister is so weird. Sometimes I wonder if we are actually related. Nothing. Alright, well, good talking to you. Let's go actually head over to the trash can and check the trash cans. Some psychic newspaper, which is actually trash, don't need it. Nothing from you. Let's see the mayor. Let's see if the mayor's home. The mayor is not home. And he's not in his garden. He's usually around here somewhere. I want to find him and give him a gift for his birthday. The more friends you are with people, the easier the game will be. People will send you things in the mail. And they'll just, uh, you'll get things easier. Let's go check on Maru's house. I wonder if she's in the lab with her father, Demetrius. If they are, we go ahead and say hi to. Yep, right there. Have I given her two gifts already? I have not. Oh, that's right, it's Sunday. Every Sunday it rolls over to where you can give them two more gifts. So talk to her. Hi. Do you have fun working on the farm? Yes, I do. Well, that's good, isn't it? I hope I have fun working on the farm, or else why would I be here? Well, I can't talk to her anymore. Let's go ahead and give her this daffodil. Thanks. It's not what she loves. I still need to go figure out what she loves. Demetrius, it's good to take a break from work every now and then. I guess that's kind of difficult when you live on a farm, though. Yeah, it's always something to do. Oh, can still talk to us. Hey, at least in the winter, you don't have to worry about crops. Yeah, in the winter, there is no farming, so I'm going to have to try and see what I'm going to do during the winter. Let's go say hi to Robin. I don't want to buy anything. I hope Demetrius doesn't blow the house up with those science experience, experiments of his. I'm not even sure what he's working on. I think it has something to do with plants. Well, hopefully he finds something that makes my work a little bit easier. Anyway, we've come over, we've talked to some people. we said hi to Maru and given her a gift for the day. Yeah, let's see, let's shake a couple of these trees. Let's see if we get some uh, pine cones. These are pine trees. I don't even see any... Oh, there we go. Pine cone. As I was saying, I don't see any worms to dig up. I 
uh, back on the farm. Let's go ahead and get these seeds in the ground. And I'm going to clear out this so I can walk back easier. Now these aren't going to be even, but oh well. More crops means more money. Let's get the beans in the ground. Two, three, four, five. Then the kale. Come on. There we go. For the kale we have to harvest with our scythe. Let me go ahead and water these real quick. And then we'll go to the beach which we actually need to get some seaweed for Linus I think it was delivery I'm running low on seaweed if someone could bring me one it would be much appreciated Linus yes so now that those are in the ground let's go run over to the ocean squirrel and get us some seaweed hopefully we can actually catch it this time Last time we just kept catching fish, which normally is not a problem at all. But when we want to get some seaweed to do this quest, that's a little bit of an issue. Oh, we can't talk to her anymore. Oh, there is the mayor. Let's give him a pine cone. Oh, it's for my birthday? Thanks. There we go. Birthday gift delivered. And now back to work. Getting that seaweed for Linus. So are there any worms or any seashells? Nope, nothing. Yeah. Birds! Fly away. No, we need to collect 300 pieces of wood so we can fix this bridge and get over here. Here's Elliot. Say hi to Elliot. Hello, I hope your new farming life is panning out as you'd hope. Eh, it's alright. Can't complain. And Willie, if you purchase a high quality rod, you'll be able to attach bait and tackle to, to the line. Bait causes fish to bite fish to bite faster. Tackle can make your job a lot easier when reeling fish in. Thank you, Willie. Since you're over here, I will go fish on this side. Get a max cast? Nope. No. <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. There we go. A fish? Nope. Broken glasses. I want. There we go. Max cast. I want some seaweed. Now, I know you can see some seaweed stuff in here, but it doesn't actually matter, as far as I know, if you're trying to catch seaweed to land in these spots. Come on, seaweed. 6 p.m. I'm not sure. Jojo Cola. Well, this will give us some energy back. Not much. If there are other items that give much better uh, energy than those. But it's free, so I'll keep it. I really can't believe it's taken this long to catch some seaweed. Watch, when we want to actually catch fish, we will get a bunch of seaweed don't actually want. I can actually just throw this out. The broken glasses and the broken CD can actually be used in, uh, later on to get uh, some resources. Some actually good resources. I missed that. Nope. Why, you... Why did you turn around like that? That was almost a max cast. Oh, it's getting pretty late. I'm not sure we are going to be able to get this quest done. Hopefully we can uh, catch it today. It was after today the quest is going to disappear. Come on, seaweed. Seaweed? Nope, it's a fish. Come on. I think my little green bar got a little bigger since my Fishing level went up. What did we get? Anchovy! It's a new record at a whole whopping 9 inches long. Is that long for an anchovy? Someone could tell me down in the comments because I actually don't know. 
It's a silver star too, so it'll sell for pretty well. 8.20 p.m. The day's going by too fast. Another fish. It's, can we get this? Can we get this? Can we get this? Oh, we got the treasure. Now we have to catch the fish. No, oh, no, oh, catch the fish. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. And we got it. We got another anchovy, eight inches long. And the treasure is a geode. Actually, not bad at all. Let's throw away this newspaper. And do a couple more attempts. We got a max cast and another fish. This looks like it's going to be somewhat easy to catch. Now, there are different fish at different times of the day during different seasons. That is one big herring. Another another record at 15 inches. And it's a silver star. Come on, I really want this seaweed. I want to get this quest done, get some extra gold. But it doesn't look like we are going to be able to get this quest done, guys. So we're gonna have to head out after this one. It's another fish. Oh, that was a big jump. Come on. There. Oh, oh close. So herring at 14 inches. And another star. All right, let's do one more. And actually, you know what? We were supposed to go over to the wizards this episode. Well, first thing next episode, as soon as we get those crops done, we will head over to the to the wizards. At actually around eleven, I don't know exactly when he opens. I don't think it's too early in the morning. I know he's open late. He's only open until eleven though, so I probably could have made it over there if I left a little sooner. But it's actually not going to happen this episode. But we did get those. We got three silver herrings, two silver anchovies, a geode, a drink that gives us some energy back, and a couple pieces of trash that will actually give us something that's worthwhile later on down the road. Actually, let's stop in the saloon and see if there's anyone new. Which doesn't seem like it. I think I've said hi to all these people. So let's just go ahead and head on back to the farm. And go ahead and sell these fish. Stow away these pieces of trash and the geode. And then call it an episode. Alright, yeah, it's getting pretty hard to see out here. Let's go over to the trash can. Make some money. Put these away. I already have a broken CD, so let's put that there and that there. Now we've got three geodes. I can't wait until we get better luck to get these broken open. Let's move this down here. I always keep the energy stuff down on this side. I don't know, I don't know it's just something that I do. It's 11.30, so let's go ahead and just head back inside and Call it a night. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got a lot from those potatoes. 14 potatoes netted us 1100 gold. And the fish only got us 185. But hey, we got a good amount. This is the biggest we've gotten so far 1305 gold that night. Well guys, thank you for watching this episode. If you liked it, please smash that like button. Even if you didn't like it, please hit that dislike button. Any kind of feedback is fantastic. And as always, I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!